Molecular action of P53 in carcinogenesis. Normal function of P53. P53 is a transcription factor which consists of four subunits. A subunit contains a C-terminal regulatory domain, a tetramerization domain, a DNA binding domain, and an N-terminal transactivation domain. P53 monomers form tetramers via the association of the tetramerization domains. The P53 tetramer binds to P53 consensus sequences in the DNA. Transcription factors bind to the transactivation domain and mediate the transcription of the gene by RNA polymerase II. Deletion of both TP53 alleles. In tumors such as bone and soft tissue sarcomas, both TP53 alleles may be deleted. In this case, P53 is no longer synthesized. Consequently, P53 dependent genes are not transcribed. Mutation of one TP53 allele, conformational change of wild type P53, dominant negative mutation, inhibition of DNA binding. In many tumors, one TP53 allele carries a point mutation, whereas the second allele is wild type. When mutant P53 monomers associate with wild type monomers, the wild type monomers are forced into a different conformation. Binding to P53 DNA consensus sequences is blocked, and the respective genes are not transcribed. Tetramers consisting of mutant P53 monomers only, inhibition of specific DNA binding, binding to non-B DNA. In cases where one TP53 allele is mutated and the second allele is wild type, some of the resultant tetramers consist of mutant P53 monomers only. Similarly, mutant-only tetramers are present when the wild type allele is deleted. Mutant-only tetramers cannot bind to P53 consensus sequences in the DNA. Instead, they may interact with non-B DNA, the conformation of which differs from double-stranded DNA. Amplification of the MDM2 gene, inhibition of transcription. The MDM2 gene is amplified in about one-third of human soft tissue sarcomas. The gene product, shown in yellow, binds to the amino terminal transactivation domain of P53. MDM2 associated with the transactivation domain inhibits the binding of transcription factors to the transactivation domain. In this way, transcription of the target genes is blocked. Amplification of the MDM2 gene, ubiquitination and proteolysis of P53 oligomers. MDM2 is an E3 ubiquitin ligase. After binding to the N-terminal domain of P53, MDM2 is involved in the formation of multi-ubiquitin chains from ubiquitin monomers, indicated as black dots. Ubiquitinated P53 is degraded in the proteasome. Infection with human papillomaviruses, ubiquitination and proteolysis of P53 oligomers after association with E6 and E6AP proteins.
Some types of human papillomaviruses are causal agents in the formation of cervical carcinomas. The viral proteins E6 and E6AP, a ubiquitin ligase, bind to P53. Both proteins mediate ubiquitination of P53. Ubiquitinated P53 is degraded in the proteasome.